welcome to Ready Player Dumb. We are playing Grand Theft Auto 3, and we are headed towards the sea. Not the ocean, but the letter that's on the map. <laughs> it's the only thing on the map. We've yeah, done have everything. We, have we met with a sea before? Oh, wait, no, I think that's Catalina. I think that's our old girlfriend that we're going Wasn't Catalina the one who just tried to blow me up? Yeah. Hmm, wait a minute. Does that mean we have 13 missions left in the game? Whoa. The wild thing is we're only 42%. Like, like for those that 100% the game, don't worry. That's not my intention with this game. But I'm just like, wow, they have a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. What do you got? Who are the only two presidents that speak in the Hall of Presidents attractions at Walt Disney World Resort? Um, I believe it's, uh, I'm going to guess, because mm -hmm. I'm kind of trying to remember, but I think Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's one of them. And then the most current, or the current president. Yeah, that would be my guess other than... Maybe George Washington and Abe Lincoln. Does it say what two, what, how is it worded? Who are the only two presidents that speak in the Hall of Presidents attraction at the Walt Disney World yeah, Resort? I'm going to stick with my answer. Okay. Let's see. Abraham Lincoln and Bill Clinton. <laughs> I don't know if that's changed oh, since absolutely. whenever this game but, was. But why would, I don't know why this game was. But I don't know, like, I'm guessing that's when it came out? No, I'm sorry, when this game came out? Maybe. Because I'm like, that's, look, all I'm saying is that when we went, Donald Trump was talking to us. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't know if I believe that. It was Bill Clinton. Yeah, I wonder if they were just a little short-sighted on... They should have probably put the current president. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what they've... Cause that, that's not a new attraction, is it? Because like, maybe when it came out, it was like, oh, cool, they had Bill Clinton talk. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I wonder if, like, Abraham Lincoln was like, it's the democracy that is the most important part of the world. And then Bill Clinton stands up and he goes, I did not have sex with that woman. And then sits down and everyone applauds. <laughs> wow, they nailed Bill Clinton. And how he nailed her. All right. All right, Sarah. All right, let's see what this is. Let's see what this is. The, the exchange. exchange. I like how you said it better. Bueno, pa que es idiot? One of these scoff face idiots. Oh, we have a thing. Yeah, I think we're acting as bait. Seems dangerous. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we got a lot of people to shoot. A lot of guys. The real question is, did you turn up to rescue Maria or to get me back? Well, I got news for you. Shooting you will be a pleasure, but dating you was only business. You are muy pequeñito, amigo. Throw over the cash. I'm so mad. You have been a PC boy, but you haven't learned. I'm not to be trusted. Yeah. Kill the oh. idiot. Okay. Boom. <laughs> Boom. I, I didn't realize it was slow motion at first. Get Catalina. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Did I do a good job? No. At least this one, like, this is the checkpoint. There's no, like, driving to it. Yeah. Oh. 
I just need to... Oh. I know now's not the time, but... <sighs> they took my weapons. Hmm. Yeah, I, you showed up unarmed. Because that guy patted you down and let you in. Oh, okay. Oh. A vehicle. Mm -hmm. Is, are we assuming that Catalina's in the house? I am. Okay. I'll stop shooting. Alright. Um, did mm. you see how skinny this guy's arm was? Mm. It was like noodle. Captain Noodle Story. What the? Um, are you able to shoot the door down? Maybe. Maybe you should shoot a bullet if you can. No. Get in the car. See if it does anything. The heart? heart yeah. That's a gold heart. Oh, Ooh. It's, yeah. Alright, that's great. And um, try in the back again? Get Catalina. Where the fuck is Catalina? Maybe try in the back again. Alright, but I ran through the whole back. Okay. Catalina. drive around. Okay, you think I can, like, see if this door open? Catalina orders you to be killed, and then leaves, taking Maria as her hostage. Escape the mansion while collecting as much firepower as you can. Follow the helicopter to find Catalina. Oh, God. Thank you, whoever opened the door. All right. Where is this so cold? Oh, there it is. Oh, I probably killed my time. That was not very clear. Yeah. That was a very rough deal. Going to the dam. Dam. Oh, she going to the back end of the dam? Oh wait, no. There. Can I get there? I'm confused. Am I still chasing the hog? Eh, ah, fuck it. Fight your way to a weapon cache. Wait. Uh, Boom. Fight your way through goons towards Catalina at the dam. Catalina takes off in a copter and shoots missiles at you. So I'm down here, should I not be? I Fuck, I probably need to be up there. I destroyed my... I'm sure this... There might be so much time associated with this mission purely because of the, like, the level of figuring out. Mm. I do wonder if I could just... So the helicopter's going to shoot at me? Apparently. Because I could blow it up. I could. Yeah, I think you want to drive across the dam.
I'm gonna blow up. Just. I'm pro. Oh wait, no, I can't. I can't blow it up. I don't have my bazooka. Yeah, drive across the dam. And then just like turn. Um, I think somewhere along that road there'll be like a grouping of um, her cars uh, blocking the road down into the dam area. And you're gonna fight your way through that and yeah, go on this dirt road. This one? Yep. I'm watching the YouTube saying he went that road. I don't see any way to get there. One second. I was just at that building. Damn. I have to do this again. Okay, when it transitions to that dirt road, you just turn right down the hill. Oh. On this side? I think that's like. See, she's got to the left. There's vehicles there. Oh, okay. There's more vehicles up at the top of whatever entrance there is into the dam. Okay, so. Leave me alone, I'm running out of time, but I see. Weird. I don't mm -hmm. totally Failed. love the. Well, you just take the road. I just take the road. That, this road here. This road and then to get the... me there. Are you telling me this road turns into the dam? Room? Oh, damn. I'm the one watching the walkthrough video. I'm telling you. I think we got this figured out. Okay. I think we're good now. Si, si, bueno. Pa que sirio. I think, I think that's everybody. Okay. Drive over here. Good. I'll get an achievement. For collecting only 13? Uh-uh. 14. I know where another package is in this mission. And Mama didn't do something to little Buford. Then whoop. Mm -hmm. I should shoot that helicopter down just for the game to be like, well, you killed Maria. And like, ooh. Like, yeah. I went down there mm -hmm. last time. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. I didn't get the shield. Mm. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Oh, these poor people. 
chose the wrong day to go to the death. Get out and shoot. Yeah. Not dumb. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, am I out? Come on. Getting that to, uh, health is really gonna. Oh, don't go this way, lady. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ooh. Ogden Steers served as the voice of how many characters in the animated feature Pocahontas? One, two, or three? David bueno, Ogden Steers. I'm gonna guess two. Do you have any idea who he is? I almost want to say he might be the person that does, uh... Oh my god, what's his name? The little henchman guy. Honey, nanny, nanny, honey, nanny, nanny. I just blanked on his name. Wigan. His name is Honey, nanny, nanny. No, his name is Wigan. But I could be wrong. Well, either guess, guess the number one, two, or three. You guess two. Mm -hmm. See, at this point, like, I'm just throwing out a blind guess, mm -hmm. but that's okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to guess. You know what? Mm -hmm. The fact that this was asked a question, everyone's going to assume it's multiple. Yeah. I'm going to say one. Okay. Two. Governor Radcliffe and Wiggins is the same person. <laughs> what? <laughs> I forgot that it's the same person who does Radcliffe. Uh, he does Wigan. The also. big baddie is also the little henchman guy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, I do what I do. What I do what I do. So I wonder if I could just drive through the bullshit. Yeah. What new record label was started by the Walt Disney Company in 1990 to release mainstream music? Disney Radio? I don't know. <laughs> Re record label. Oh, yeah. Record label. I have no idea. Buena Vista Music. Uh, Hollywood Records. Oh. I didn't know that was there. I'm gonna just try to crash through all of this. Last time I kind of worried too much about yeah. trying to kill the people. This time I'm just gonna be like, I'm just coming through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think this is the way to go. Careful of these, both of these here. I don't know. Oh, that was a double whammy. Oh, yeah. Hey! Get this thing airborne! No. Uh, now what am I supposed to do? Um, I think there's a weapon staff somewhere. I think you're backtracking from basic dawn. Please. I already know that it's not going to have it at get this thing airborne. It's going to have it at the beginning, isn't it? Probably. It always does. Si, si, bueno. Fuck it. I don't know if that's a glitch. I wonder if it's supposed to do that. I 
I'm just gonna let myself die here. Had a bad start. Okay, so you'll basically go up to where the helicopter took off. There's like. So I run. Is there stairs or something? Yeah. Okay. So there's, get out of the car and and run yeah, up the stairs. There's a bazooka up there. Bueno, up the did this guy do what I did? Where he just like? No, this guy literally like. Uh, killed everyone. Killed everybody on foot. Like, left his car at the entrance. Of the camp. In addition to filling the role of Uncle Remus in Song of the South, which animated character from the same film did James Basket lend his voice to? Br'er Rabbit, Br'er Fox, or Br'er Frog? One of these scoff face idiots. Br'er Fox. Or Br'er Frog? Mm -hmm. I don't remember Br'er Frog, so I'm going to guess Br'er Frog. I was kind of thinking that too, but maybe also a rabbit just in general because he's like the main character that he's narrating let's see who's right you're still standing oh, he did brer fog huh oh walt disney world i don't even know when the new Tomorrowland opened at the Walt Disney World Resort, what was the new name given to the Star Jets attraction? I don't even know. The what jets? Star Jets. Um, Is it People Mover? Astro Orbiter. Astro Orbiter? Yep. Boom, Sarah. Wow. Who does Donald Duck steal from in order to pay for his date in the Daisy, with Daisy in the cartoon Donald's Crime? <laughs> Who does he steal money from? Donald's Crime. I don't um, think I've seen this short. I think there's some weapons I haven't picked up. I'm just gonna guess Pete. Shit. Pete. That's a good guess. Um, or does he steal from Daisy? <laughs> His date. <laughs> I'm gonna guess uh, Uncle Scrooge. I know it's not that, but. Um, <laughs> His nephew. <laughs> oh, wow. He stole from Huey, Dewey, and Louie. That's pretty good. Uncle Donald. In the Disney film Mary Poppins, according to Mary Poppinson's tape measure, who is extremely stubborn and suspicious. Hmm. According to whose tape measure? Mary Poppins. When she measures up people. And I think she only does that to Jane and Michael. So it's either Jane or Michael. Very stubborn and what? Suspicious. I'm going to guess Michael. I'm thinking Jane. Yeah. Michael. Damn it. Because I think he has like that squint. That. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was picturing it, but I was trying to think of, yeah, maybe Jane's more like, huh, would have. Which character from the Disney animated feature, Alice in Wonderland, sings the song A-E-I-O-U? From oh, Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> well, I know the answer. A E I O U. A E I O U. What a trip. U E I A O U. Something like that. He like starts spinning it up. Who is it though? The caterpillar. Yeah. 
For a brief time, what character in the Disney animated feature Robin Hood goes by the alias Sir Reginald Duke of Chutney? <laughs> Robin Hood. In the film Davy Crockett, King of the Wild Frontier, what state does Crockett represent in Congress? Texas! Tennessee. <laughs> <laughs> Born, Born on, on the, the mountain tops, Tennessee. Tennessee. <laughs> I always did Texas because we had that one where it's like... I swear he died. He died at the Alamo. Yeah. I like that I got that one right. Yeah. And I was like, oh yeah, they all did die. <laughs> they all did. Um, Maybe it's in the song huh? about him dying at the Alamo. I'm just trying to think of. We'll see. Let me look at the lyrics. Davy. I just know that like on my Frontier playlist, I have the Davy Crockett, and then I have uh, Al like an Alamo song, and he's mentioned in it. And the Alamo, like basically, it's just retelling the story of the Alamo. Um, Davy. Crockett lyrics. Do, 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 do. I would really like to succeed this time. He went off to Congress and served a spell, fixing up the governments and laws as well. Took over Washington, so he heard tell. And patched up the crack in the labor group. Uh, let's see. Holy when he came, come home, his politicking done, his western march had just begun, so he packed his gear and his trusty gun, uh, and let out a grinning to follow the sun. His land is the biggest and his land's the best, from the grassy plains to the mountain crest. He's ahead of us all, meeting the test, following his legend into the west. And that's it. He didn't mention anything about him dying in the Alamo. So I guess... Died in the Alamo. <laughs> in Beauty and the Beast, what was the beast's only window to the outside world? The only window to the outside world. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're right. <laughs> you don't kill that guy. Mm. So I just need to go towards Get the building. This thing airborne. And there'll be stairs. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. oh, cars on fire. I know. <laughs> <laughs> What's the beast's only window to the outside world? window to the outside world? Um, this is this feels like such a specific question that it has to be like referenced in the movie. Do you know the answer to this? I do. It's a thing that's barely used in the film, like. It's an item. I mean, like, there's the rose. Yeah. Uh, it's not the rose. It's not the rose, though. But there's another item that is enchanted that he uses. Uh, the mirror. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Because she uses it to see her dad. And then she up. uses it again to show the beast to the townspeople and... That was a mistake. And then it's never... <laughs> look at you know, how... Those are the look only how, two times. Look how handsome my boyfriend is. <gasps> All right. Well, I failed again. Yeah. So when we come back in Ready Player Dumb, we will try this again. We're getting closer. Maybe I'll try, like, to actually take people out one by one. But I just don't feel like I have the time to do that. If I, if I could just get enough of a vehicle uh, to the stairs. Mm-hmm. Then I could get out of there. So, okay. We'll see next time on Ready Player Down. Goodbye.